spousal abuse, especially when violence is part of the abuse, is difficult to navigate. Here are some tips if you are still living with an abuser and making a safety plan to leave. Practice. Practice how you will get out of the house. If you have kids, practice with them. Learning self-defense is a good idea if you fear confrontation and it is likely that the abuser may find out about your plan to leave in the process of trying to leave. Try to make a habit of always keeping your phone ready to call 911. Include friends and family in on your plan. This may seem daunting if your abuser has isolated you and made threats referring to your family and friends, but it's important that others are aware of what's going on. If you can, have a copy of important paperwork that you can readily take with you if you have to leave quickly. This would include passports, immigration paperwork, birth certificates, and anything else that you may need to escape. Finally, brainstorm excuses for leaving the house that the abuser will be least likely to question. For example, um, if it's normal to make a grocery run or go for a walk at a certain time of day, just whatever seems most plausible, least suspicious that you can use on the fly, things become dangerous.